Welcome to the another episode of Abstract Thesis series. In this series, we are digging deep into the Power BI concepts. If you have not subscribed, subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon so that you can get notification for our new video. Hello and welcome to another video of Abstract Thesis series. And in this video, we will see how can we get two wages on small multiple. If you would have watched our last video where we have used the calculation group, uh, we created a uh, few calculation groups and I'm going to show you one of the calculation group which we created. So I open the tabular editor and what I've done is I went here, I right clicked and I say need create new calculation group and I went to the calculation group and I simply added all my majors into the calculation group. So simply I went ahead and you know added my majors. So I say went to calculation item, say new calculation item and simply added my all my majors here. Now when I save it, refresh and come back, I have my calculation group out here. Now after that we have done a few modification but you will or at least get this selected major. Inside this one the major set which we are going to use is this one. So if I bring it here you will see all the six majors which you have there. Now what I want here is basically, let me create it into a slicer and let me do one more thing here. Let me bring in here from the date table so I'm going to bring once here and I'll tell you why I'm doing that and net here the second thing I'm going to bring a visual out here which is clustered column visual and then I'm going to do one more thing here is I'm going to bring in here on this clustered column visual also and then I bring in net here as a value. Now I see the net value, this is my net value and I, if I want gross value here, I can see the gross values also here. Now what I want here is I don't want like this. So this is my uh, net value, this is my gross value one one two three three double zero. So what I want is I want them one above another. I want uh, a display where you know they share the common axis which is this one, not this axis. Okay, so let me remove this and we have created this calculation group and I go to my calculation group and I bring it on the small multiple. Now you see that they, there is something known as COGS target, gross target, net target and all those are there. And there's a COGS, gross and net. So there is two, uh, two majors on one row. So first of all, what I'm going to do is I'm going to simplify. I'm going to keep only net and gross but they are side by side, okay? And then you see empty space and we are going to do correction around that. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to the format and first thing, they are not net. So I go to my Y axis and I look at the property which is title and it cannot be dynamic right now, so I switch it off. Okay, so I don't need title because anyway we are displaying what, what we are showing. Now I go to grid layout and I wanted to I want to change it that I want like only one column. So now I have gross on the top and net this one and let's validate it. This is should be 1123320 and this is 866 and this is the same value which is there. So what we have done is now because we converted this majors into dimensions, uh, we are able to see these. This is the common axis and then we have, you know, net here and gross here. So in this way, what we have done is we created a calculation group and using that calculation group, we actually bought the majors on as a small multiples and now they are sharing the common axis. So now let's take, let's do a little bit of this thing now. Instead of year, if I take month here, Okay, and let me convert it into line visual. So now look at this is the one thing which you know you were looking forward for quite some time. Now, the challenge here is it's going to show you this as net only because only major it should see as a value is a net. Okay. But we you this is the gross and the title is gross. You can see the title is gross, but it shows value is a net, and this one is that because this is the major uh, net which we have dragged. Now, 
we need any major out here we, we are not limited to something so we can create a selected major we can create a major with name selected major something like that and then we can use that so instead of that it will start showing the major selected major name or something like that okay so now this is what is you know uh what we call the axis common axis where we, one of the axes is common and the majors are displayed one above another one now you can go here and go to data colors and now because both of them are net there is no option out here to change it out okay so uh, you will not be able to do much around things around that but at least we have uh, this flexibility now to you know at least convert it into a, a major to dimension conversion uh, this we can do so go ahead and try this out and do let us know what else you want us to cover in this particular series thanks for watching this video thank you keep watching keep asking questions in comments subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so that you can get notification for new videos thank you